comes. Sanwanani Dumelang mo leni bantu abata. I'm so excited to announce that Lifigile Ilkoshal got TOMZ, the best side tech entertainment in the land. Only on your number one channel, SABC One. Mzantu for sure, but fair too. And you know how it goes. For the next 30 minutes, we're going to be taking you guys into a journey to the world of life, science, and technology. What I'm saying is no difference. You got your two hosts, your Moses. I go by the name of C A W D. I pronounce Katie, and I'm Hamini One. But fair too. Hamba no bunda bantuana. Hello. How are you? Okay. I'm good. That's the long clean. You know you owe me a, like a lunch. Yeah, actually I'm gonna it's buy you something. lunch. Yeah, I'll buy you lunch. Try. Speaking of lunch, into any and the tanda apa imsha beni is food. Yeah. Oh my gosh, there's nothing better than just chilling after a long day's work and having a warm meal. What about like lunch in the middle of the day, Minji? But go to work say no plow maybe so yeah. And the one thing that's actually really booming right now is I'm a food trucks. Food trucks. Yep. We're about to just make creative dishes, quick trucks, or any caravans. You know, anything can happen there. Uh -huh, most definitely. And now, my face puts in pete. One time, we're gonna meet a creator who actually started a business. Mm -hmm. Food truck. She's gonna tell us more about that. Why are we still here? I'm, I'm so ready to go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Discover the wonders behind the food truck by meeting a lady who uses the opportunity to build a new career and making it big on the road. Spawn how you can prevent food poisoning and we travel by wagon to see where the first food truck started and by the speed of light into the future. And of course, we'll test the know-how to of Mzanti with our epic quiz. So, what do you guys think of our online questions? Hmm. It's time for social media, but fair Samira say go social media and buzo go to what is your favorite food on Facebook. Peto Ezekiel underscore 23 Otiana. He loves fast food. It's fun and jinga makota and I'm a hot dog. And on Facebook, we've got Utato underscore yellow Otiana. I love African cuisine. Well, guys, keep those comments coming on Facebook. See TOMZ. On Twitter, it's Tom's underscore SABC underscore one. Some people say, I'm going share your school to check out what you guys had to say. Check this out. We still at the game affairs with our road show. I'm trying to say Tuto Kito High School. So cool, my guy, banding it as a Right next to me is a young gentleman. Fit out him. Fit in, Sean. Oh, grand. Yeah, and sharp. 100. Yeah, 100 percent. Oh, banding kamalak. Dinkazumu. Okay, dinkazumu. Long phone, kenane. You need food truck. The food truck. The food truck is that. If fun and jang abantu about faga e truck e bazambi se inda wez ni be be low day e e ukul. I truck le. That carries food and delivers them to companies to sell. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, cool. I'm a food truck, so I'm a food truck. I'm a food truck. I'm a farming. I'm a farming. The people in farms are farm, farm the fruits and vegetables, then they send them to big companies. Okay, cool. So, boy, tell me, what do we need to do next to prevent food poisoning? You have to check expiring dates. Yeah. If when you had to open your own food truck, ne? Thing is good. We will track out things. Good. What's the thing is that? What's the thing is that? I rice in my ice cream. Oh, but I turned the ice cream guy. Turned the rice. Eh, the chicken rice and chicken. Okay, guys. Now can I mona a food truck? Oh, I am slumbe. Nice seventies. Let's just watch the short clip to see exactly what they are. A food truck can be classified as a large vehicle that is equipped to upega and sell ugudla. Ogunyu things are ugudla that are pre-packaged, while others have a whole kitchen on board that can prep food from scratch. Fast food types foods are very common for these trucks, and they often serve a bantu that are always on the go, such as workers in the city. They are considered to be part of a street food scene, which experts estimate feed about 2.5 billion people every day. Yeah. An old army wagon became the first food truck in history in 1866 when a Keto rancher sold dried beans, coffee, and salted beef from one. Four years later, food trucks had moved into the city, but taking some sandwiches, ama pie, a coffee to busy workers. From the 1880s, Thomas Barclay built lunch wagons in the USA, which had amazinki, itofu, and even amafriji in them. Early ice cream trucks were popular because most families didn't have amafriji. They used dry ice to keep the ice cream cool. And of course, my fair, so if making food on the go is not enough for you, food truck rallies have taken off, Nyanjaya. That's right. In the US, the biggest rally to ever take place mm -hmm. was in 2014. Yep. And they had a staggering 121 trucks that took place to parade. Shut the front door. Wow. Yo, that is a lot of meals on wheels. Otherwise, guys, we're going to take a short air break. Maybe grab a snack, Nyana. We'll see you after this. Um.
TOMZ is back on your TV screen. Most definitely, but first, and I'm sure we're talking about something that actually excites the both of us. Ugoja, guys, like Tan Ugoja, me and Anobun, but we lunch time, we get so excited. And right about now, calling this Kazaka cool, that's actually happening all over the world. This trend, I love it. Food trucks. Imagine. And the nice thing about that is that Yenzeka and Alapa Mzad's Africa. Let's watch, guys. So dividend with another entrepreneur who's decided to take the business of street food trucks to new heights. Pamela, I cannot stand it any longer. I must go check it out. I wonder what sort of a uh, storm she's cooking up Nam Flange. Let's go. Hi Wendy. Okay. See my Wendy's food palace here, my dear. This is my shop, right? That's why I prepare everything early in the morning. Mm -hmm. That's what I do. Like, as you see, my pots are ready. You see? Almost. It's getting all boiled up. Yes. <laughs> and here is my water for pump. Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. So it's almost ready. Then now I'm doing all this, you know, the meat. Mm -hmm. This is the steak. Because what I'm making is yes, the ugul that we're seeing too. Okay. Abo beef stew can say maybe traditional food. Okay. Because in Kerala, Oh, so it's been like sasla, abo chakalaka. I'm a serving some like salad. This kegi papa, abo beef stew, chicken stew, and not the I want those dry pig chickens. Okay. People they like any the hard body the chicken. The real deal. <laughs> that they call it. In Goku is a Makai. Okay. Mm. So, what do you think of business here? What do you think of this? It's a fish or something. It's a fish. 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 So, it's a chicken. Oh, it's a chicken. So, the tin is in the dishes. Yeah, it's a chicken. 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 Okay. 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 It's a steak. It's a steak. It's a steak. It's a steak. It's a so we have the nindo. Then the fish, the chips. Sorry, chips. Yes. My next card is early in the morning also. I'm a go hotel. I'm gonna early in the morning also. So it means you never never variety. It never variety. Mhm. So what food are you and the chips? Hmm. Yes. Yes. Indo. You can make it. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's some of my customers coming in the morning for coffee. Because I make also coffee tea. Mm-hmm. So must get snow going a little shiny because you know I'm eyeing it right now. So we end the ganjan, we scoop oil in yama ogany kani spice ogany. No spice just tomato, onion, carrot, green pepper, tomato. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Uncle, last year this business. So how did you go about starting it? Came up. I come back location. Bazo, bazo, yente la apa. I go na dosa. It takes time. Ya but tabanga. I think we into a bit of mundo na kiselgu we. Into mundo na kiselgu yo. So vele into enjani. Your homework every day. So we hamba check his in dao. Go about ya go na imteto. The metros, the health department. So my wedding bunny was not this. I was a woman in a caravan, ne visa, ne case, young alone. Love for you, I won. Love for you, I won again. Myself, I won. 
I was pushing myself into and isn't though as it do liganga was busy ganga we are gonna go to the not that expensive if you're saving money. Yeah, I shall have all sisters are doing it shim. Lay work out. Oh, that needs to be sorted properly in order for it to be safe to eat. If a guga is left out of the fridge for more than two hours, bacteria, parasites, and viruses can quickly spread inside them. As Katsina is saying, you won't even know about it because all these organisms don't produce a stinky smell or even change the color of the food. Most of the illnesses from Uguja can be prevented by Ukpega Uguja Gahe. You also need to make sure you always handle food with clean hands, wash fruits before eating them, Ukeze Amatispun Wako and the surfaces where you put food in the kitchen, and keep cold food where it needs to be. So, Ma Wendy, you've always had a passion for cooking. Eh? So, what's part of the of the life story and how you came to this point, Nam Sanj? Ah, <laughs> dear. That is it. Even now, I'm going to spend some time spices. Ne, I was a helper. Yeah, when I was a helper, they cooking, also doing cleaning, cooking. I'm a coffee making man. Coffees, espresso coffees. I'm back here like in Langeve, and they did like me there. And then what happened? I just lost the job like that. <laughs> so. Since I lost my job, So, Gemma Wendy, what pushed you to start a business here, Because you get I thought I'm going to know me. In my hands, and you get to a business. Actually, you get to learn it. Yeah, yeah, boy. Because you get so low, yeah, boy. Now, you get to go because you get to like. <laughs> selling beauty products, selling clothes. I have one good tie. I'm from Banenja. One thing I'm like business like this. Even if I can get a saloon, a shop, maybe a running shop, front business like selling even clothes, a shop my own. Yeah, So you entrepreneur in Jewen. So I got to learn to to learn a new phone. Ale, you and then a new phone with the law. Man got to learn to learn. Yes, we think it's over right in life. So called playing a winner, do you think it's important for Aban to, to follow a dreams? Zabo, Futiba, Bas Sebenze. You can. You can. As long as you push yourself, you can. Nothing is impossible. You can. As I'm here now, <laughs> it's my dream. Mm. And I'm working hard it yeah. As long as my was with you really, I want yeah, yeah, in the if you eat food that still has harmful bacteria in it, you could get food poisoning. Abantu get food poisoning each year, and it can be dangerous and serious. Amayama symptoms are corner include diarrhea. Some of the bacteria are most likely to cause food poisoning than others. The best way to avoid getting sick from food is to assume that all foods have bacteria in it. Then make sure you eat hot foods as soon as possible. And if you ever in doubt, throw it away. So can't let our organic be on as any challenges as Tile that we can't necessarily control wins and when. Every business has weaknesses, or can you eat threats as call your souls the tin is like I want to have us and do it like I do like I won. Good like I do like very expensive the meat. And so yes, the challenge is that we take on a look and we choose the end if profit is not easy. So when I went and came, because when they profit, it's just not easy. As a dish, I can only to make a dish. Because I'm going to scale. Oh, okay. Uh huh. So we are going to rationalize the inyama. Uh huh. So when I went and went and in order to keep the customers zako. Yes, I'm not just a dish. I'm going to sell and just okay. Uh huh. Yeah. The quality of good again, yeah, show by the his. quality of the meat is it's the good quality of the meat. Mm. Mm. No. Delicious. Amazing. I don't want to get Yasin, actually, I've got a question. If guys need to pull up my food truck, you know, take it and the food in your business and my food truck win. I mean, I know exactly what I'm going to call my food so truck. So where you guys and Baba Benki let's see, Nana. Record breaking. <laughs> <laughs> Wa 
Welcome back, you guys. Still tuning to Teenagers on a Mission. Kona lago SABC One. I'm Zanti for sure. Guys, before the ad break, Ubuntu didn't want me to tell you something. Ne, if me I had a food truck, when you be zange record raking. I'll tell you all about it on social media. Follow me on social media. I'll tell you what happened. Wow. Okay. Okay. Caddy did have some sort of snack during the break, so that's why he's a bit jittery. Okwango, kukoto ake. Namtanje, we are on about food. Especially food on trucks, and we're gonna meet up with a young lady who decided to get her way out of a bad situation. What color is business? Yake about food. Yep, food on the go. Check this out, guys. So, my Wendy, it responds from a band to came with your serving. It's in. Mm, I've got a name. Uh -huh. I can say. <laughs> I've got a name out there. You know, I've got a name out there. Like amazing. Bang tan, has it gone? I can feel it more. So if you know about that, I mean, I tan the food. Bang tan the bang is better. I mean, I tan. So you know, you learn to only put a relationship. Kakuno, kakuno, kuti bang Caesar na bokona la. Bang Caesar. So you come paga to chill it out. Bang tan. I mean, I go and do it. I go na nizela. Man, oh man, oh man, we have seen it all, Nam Sanje. It's so disgusting, my Wendy. It's changing the world around her. Just goes to show that you must have hard-working abilities, fortitude, determined, and anything is possible. If she can do it, so can we, guys. You guys saw it here. I've got TOMZ signing out. Ladies and gentlemen, you know what time it is. It's time for the TOMZ quiz. For more about whether you guys have been paying attention, we're going to talk about the dynamic and we're going to talk about the on our social media pages. Right about now, it's time to talk about whether you see Pascal versus Vagashele. We're going to talk about is it the green team or the blue team that won? Check this out. Hey yo, you know what time it is. It's time for the TOMZ quiz. <laughs> So this is where we get two teams to battle each other, the green team and the blue team. Konamanje, it's got so good to see my shoes. Before we do that, sing each other good to know that I'm going to join you. On social media, on Facebook, it's TOMZ. On Twitter, it's Tom's underscore, ASAPC underscore one. Before we start the game, the blue team and the green team need to choose their three champions. Blue team, green team, please choose your three champions! <laughs> Okay, guys, so the blue team has selected their three champions and the green team have selected their three champions. It's Katsugu to Maje, Silva Mita. So, Kala Nga Pagu blue team. Guys, in the clan? It's great. Okay, cool. Funi Nchela Maka Mawe, ne? Besi Ni Nchela Gutu, why Ban Ketit? Ni Kamala Ndi Sanya. Ban Ketit, Longo Vale Timi and Trust. Okay, okay, okay. Ni Kamala Ndi Ngu Pindi, Li Ban Ketit, because Ki Tsuman Chungu Lung. Okay, okay. My name is Mona Sipaji and all of those people know that I'm the best. Give it up for the blue team! Are you guys ready? Yes, we are ready. Yes. Okay, if you want to come back to me, and if you want to come back to me, and if you want to come back to me, I am the one who they chose me because I am good at choosing options. Okay, yeah, man. Push your followers because they love me. Okay, okay. So let's go to the blue team. Yeah, they're talented. Give it up for the green team! Okay, guys, in the back so we've got two puzzles. Now, I'm going to make a puzzle win. I'm going to make a puzzle win. I'm going to make a question. The first team to press the puzzle gets to answer the questions. If you told her right, it's 10 marks. If you have the answer, send press the puzzle. I'm going to make a team win, but only for five marks. No, I'm going rules. Sure, sure. Can we please have the first question? First question. What did early ice cream trucks use to keep ice cream cool? Is it A, dry ice? Is it B, Engine powered freezers? Is it C? Plastic insulation boxes? Is it D? Nothing. Which one is it? Prasad, Funeng is the sound, guys. Okay, cool. The green team, you have to the color. Guys, answer your name. Upi. Upi. Are you sure? Okay, I'm going to go to. We answer a bit right or wrong. And the answer is A. Ah. Askis, askis. Let's move on to the second question. Question two. Which precautions should you take to prevent food poisoning when cooking? Is it A, buy organic foods? Is it B, heat food longer? Is it C, wash hands? Or is it D, warm plate for serving? Okay, cool. The blue team got it first. Which one is your answer? C. Are you guys sure? Yes. Okay, cool. But the answer will see. 
And the Arte C give it up for the blue team. Green team, green team, be ready. This is the last question. And third question, what was the first food truck converted from? Is it A, a US Army wagon? Is it B, a horse carriage? Is it C, an ambulance? Or D, a car? Which one is it? Okay, green team was fast enough. Guys, the answer in the team. We are going for A. For A. B. B. Sean, you can ask your team. A, horse carriage. Okay, so it's answer in the Okay, cool. Let's see whether the answer is correct or incorrect. But the answer will be, is it? And the answer is A. Uh, guys, unfortunately, it is the end of the show. We score points here to Ganjena. The green team is on zero points. And the blue team is on 10 points. You can also play with us on our social media pages on Facebook, see Tom's on Twitter, Tom's underscore SAPC underscore one. Give it up for the blue team! Yes, Ogbana food trucks is actually kind of awesome. So what's in store for these trucks in the future? In the future, robot arms will cook for us. Imagine. 3D printers will also print fresh food right after our plate. Smart ovens will control the temperature of food and monitor it with cameras. Yo! Cooking appliances will offer nutritional information and suggest recipes. And nano packaging will keep food fresh for longer without using preservatives. Oh man, we've come to the end of the show, which is the part I hate. I hate this part right here. But I'm gonna call you a The revolution still carries on on our social media pages. We are active 24 7. On Twitter, we are Tom's underscore SAPC underscore one. On Facebook, we are TOMZ. I'm Fresh by Kato on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Mundo underscore PN and Stogreezy. But if you do need more information about TOMZ, do visit www.tomz.co.za. But for now, goodie bye. Don't forget to break your drink. <laughs> goodie bye. <laughs> <laughs> Next time on TOMG! Shangana with a South African who doesn't stand back in the face of adversity and wants to make sure that everyone knows how important social change is from Zanzi for now and years to come. So what is social change and social change is all about what? A celebrating some of the most incredible social change movements in history. Discover how technology will influence the way we bring about change in the future. And make sure you listen up closely, you want to get these quiz answers right. Don't forget to watch Tom's same time, same place, Konelago SABC1, Zanti for sure.